Hi Capricorn, this is your weekly day by day tarot cards reading by Emma for the week starting 11th of January 2021. We will have two cards per day every day of this week. So Monday, 11th of Jan. Seven of Cups, Tuesday. Strength, Wednesday, Two of Wands. Thursday, Queen of Cups. Friday, Knight of Wands. Saturday, the Hierophant. And Sunday, of oh, Two. Okay, Five of Cups and Knight of Cups. All right. The Star, your hopes, your dreams, your end goal. That's the Star energy for you. Lovely. Optimism, hopes, and dreams. Seven of Cups on Monday with Wheel of Fortune. Strength on Tuesday with Seven of Wands. Two of Wands on Wednesday with the Sun. Queen of Cups with Six of Pentacles. Thursday and Friday, Knight of Wands with Nine of Wands. The Hierophant with Three of Pentacles. And Knight of Cups, Five of Cups with King of Wands. Now, Seven of Swords. You are benefiting out of this situation and you want, which you want to leave. You don't want to be in this situation. It's a conflicting and you want to leave it behind. You don't want to be with these people, with this career, with the place where you are because you don't want, or you don't find it suitable for you. But you still want to take something out of it. You still want to have benefits of that situation. That just before this week, you're understanding that uh, that what you do right now, that group of people that you are with right now, it doesn't suit your goals. It's never going to take you to that what you are hoping for, for yourself. You see what I'm saying? And that you have to leave it behind. Wheel of Fortune definitely supports that on Monday with Seven of Cups. That's your understanding that you left the situation in order to go for your dreams. Wheel of Fortune, you are changing. You definitely change your mind. You are optimistic immediately. Seven of Cups, it's plenty option, plenty fantasies, plenty or lots of imagination. But being that you are changing in this way, it is important actually to point on that change that you are leaving the situation that you that you understand will never take you to that end goal. It's never going to fulfill your dreams. Now, that change is very important for you. You need to put yourself in the position from where you can achieve your goals. Now, Tuesday with Seven of Wands and the Strength Energy together. Now, Seven of Wands is that you are defending your your decision. Perhaps you have to defend that what you've done in here. That situation that you left, this group of people, this job, all right, this, this employment. You just left it because you understand you're never going to fulfill your dreams, that you're never going to get there where you want to be. It is not for you, simple as that. Even if it brings money, even if it brings security, it doesn't bring your dreams any closer. So now, perhaps you are asked to explain why is that you're leaving this, this security and that you firmly defending your opinion that, that you couldn't take it any longer? You didn't like it. It didn't suit you. It's not what you want for yourself. I believe that's your argument in here, but you will face opposition. You will be asked why, how, what from now. Yes, you've got your hopes, you've got your dreams, but how are you going to get there? You see what I'm saying? These are practical ideas, practical questions that you're supposed to face, you're supposed to answer. But strength energy in your environment supports you. You will control the situation. You know what you want. Change has come for you. You are firmly standing by it. You will be adamant. That what have you decided, that how it's going to be, and that's it. Two of Wands and the Sun. Lovely Wednesday. Two of Wands, we love this Two of Wands because promises big opportunity in front, big world, big goals, big ideas, all plans in your mind already there. 
you are happily looking somewhere in the future, seeing your life in a much brighter light, seeing your life as something big and prosperous. I mean, you are very energized in here, the sun card within you. That's happiness. You do have some project, okay? Something is on your mind. You do have some project. You did put these first plans. That's what I'm saying. You do have these plans that you put together. These two ones, okay? First two that stand together. This is baby that doesn't still stand on its two feet. We don't have stable, stable situation. We don't have stable moment. But it promises bright future. It promises that will grow. It promises that will stabilize eventually. You see what I'm saying? You've got this opening with these two ones. You made your gate and you can go through because you do have plans where to, what is going to be there. You are planning to uh, emigrate and you do have plan what you're going to do there, how you're going to make money, where you're going to stay. Plans are there. It could be that you are planning your business. It's not just emigration. You're planning your business. You're planning your life. Maybe you are planning that you're going to get employed, but then you know exactly what company you are taking, what way you want to get employed, where you're going to send your CVs. You see what I'm saying? There is some sort of certainty, some kind of plan you put in place for yourself. And it's not small. These are big plans. You are very energized about that. Whatever that is, whether that is your private business, employment, emigration, whatever that is. You are very optimistic, very happy about just thinking about it. Decision is not there yet. All right? You still need to make decision. But you are just about, look at this one, is already with one foot on another side. You are just about to make decision and to step into this new world, into this new career and so and so. Whatever that is new, but there's this newness, new life that you see for yourself, definitely. Very optimistic, very energized, very happy about it. Queen of Cups and Six of Pentacles. Now, Queen of Cups is Pisces, Scorpio or Cancer person in your environment. Could be your mother, all right? Now, Six of Pentacles within you says that you are helping somebody who is in need. And perhaps this person is in need. And you will be there to help this person selflessly, okay? It's not to have any sort of gain. You just want to help because you can help. And this person is in need. It could be that you are in need and that this person is helping you. You need some money for this project and this person, your mother, perhaps comes up with money and said, okay, if you need so much, there it is, carry on with your project or whatever it is that you need that money for. You know, this person understands that, that you are in need and wants to help you. You see, it's a give and take energy in here, doing favors, helping another just because you can, and you are interacting with somebody who is Pisces, Scorpio, or Cancer person on Thursday. No. Knight of Wands and Nine of Wands. Nine of Wands is you doing things perpetually over and over again. And for a very long time, you are dragging it. You already sick and tired of doing the very same things. Maybe, maybe all the time sending this application, fill up these forms. Or, I don't know, just doing the job that is full of details. And somehow it happens that you cannot conclude it. Somehow you never manage to finish. At this point on Friday, it says you have to finish it. Time has come that you have to put a dot on that. Knight of Wands, its situation has arrived. That is something suddenly that came your way. And I think that is actually a cause of this realization. Now I have to finish you know, because now this one is bringing something else. You cannot move on with that, what this Knight of Wands is bringing to you unless you completed that what you have started. It's kind of interconnected. This Knight nine of Wands, these things that you do, that you have to complete, that you were dragging for a very long time, you have to complete because this Knight of Wands is bringing something exciting, something new. And it's interconnected. You ha cannot go with that new situation that is excited and new unless you finish that what you have started, that what is 
old. You see what I'm saying? Now, the Hierophant and Three of Pentacles. Now that is new things that you do. This is very exciting. Working with these people, group of people, but is enjoyable, but it is enjoyable work. With Three of Pentacles, we will always say that it is some enjoyable work doesn't matter maybe maybe you are just working at your home you're painting your walls or you're decorating your flat could be just something like that but you are enjoying okay now you are doing your hobbies and you're enjoying you are doing something that is profession you're enjoying your visible people admiring your work you see what i'm saying this three of pentacles it's a lovely energy first money that you receive for something for a job well done you know, you started doing this new job, new career, and that's first money. Yeah, hip, hip, hooray. You see what I'm saying? Lovely three of pentacles. It's very young energy, but then when you feel very enthusiastic, very happy, you just started and it's good. You're visible, you've got money, something like that. Always enjoyable moment with three of pentacles. The Hierophant says, whatever that you do in here, carry on this tried and trusted method. All right. Do be conservative, be traditional, don't experiment. You know, just carry on, do things as you used to do it. You will succeed. That kind of combination on Saturday could be actually that you do have advisor. How to do this skill, how to do this job, this particular job that you have at, uh, at hand. Somebody who's advising you could also be something like that. Could be because Hierophant is religion, is marriage or something like that, that you are busy building around it because this is building, decorating, you know, something with your hands, something practical with your hands. You are busy in, uh, I don't know, um, volunteering at, in your church. You see what I'm saying? Something like that on Saturday. By all means, it's, it's enjoyable for you. Now, Five of Cups, Knight of Cups and King of Wands within you. Now, King of Wands within you, Capricorn is um, bringing this fire, bringing enthusiasm and confidence that you can do things on your own, that you are capable, whatever is that you're supposed to do on this day, you're capable to do it on your own. Going out doing sport, that's also King of Wands. Going somewhere in the nature, it's Sunday, to go, go hiking, be with your friends. You see what I'm saying? Also with King of Wands, something like that. But in your environment, we do have Knight of Cups, Five of Cups. Perhaps, I think on this day, you do have somebody who comes around, you know, at your place to uh, ask advice or to just tell you how it feels that feels a bit sad, okay? Somebody youngish, some around 30, 35 maybe, somebody who's maybe artistic, who's Pisces maybe, all right? You're supposed to just listen, all right? Maybe you don't even need to say anything. I mean, King of Wands is not energy that can just sit and listen. I mean, you will be loud, you will support, you will be there, you will hate people who hurt that, 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 that Piscean person, you know, you will hate them. Why did they spill these cups in front of this lovely person? You see what I'm saying? You will talk, you will be loud. And perhaps it will be just like that, just that Sunday. You're going to sit, you're going to have some drink. This person will spill it hot <laughs> in front of you, you know, tell you how it feels that it was hurtful, so and so situation and these people and you will be there for this person. And it's just like that, Capricorn. I think that's your Sunday. I think major theme of this week is this change, change that you have uh, change that you are pushing for yourself. You have decided this job, these people, this situation isn't good for me, and that was from the last week. This week you are changing. If it's not for you, if it doesn't fulfill your dreams, it's not for you. You will follow your dreams. That kind of moment for you this week, which is very dominant. The rest of it is just by the way. But anyway, enjoy it.